Last week's video was all about how to digitize old photos, slides, and negatives using only your iPhone. This week, I'm going to teach you a few tricks to organize those photos so that they appear in chronological order. Coming up next on Tech Talk America. Hey folks, and welcome to the class. If you've recently digitized a bunch of your old photos, slides, or negatives, possibly because you saw my video from last week, you've probably discovered that they appear in your photo library based on the date that they were scanned rather than chronological order. Today, I'm gonna to teach you how to fix that. To walk you through this process, let's now switch over to my Mac and let's open up the photos library. And now let's click on where it says my albums. Next, I want you to click the little plus symbol just to the right, and we're gonna create a new folder, which I'm gonna call pre-digital photos. Once you've done that, now we're going to highlight our newly created folder and click on the plus symbol next to that and select new album. We're really just gonna use this album temporarily, so for now, I'm just gonna name this album Holding Tank. At this point, I'm gonna click back into my pre-digital photos folder, and I'm gonna create an empty album for each decade of photos. So for now, let me create a folder for the 1990s. Then I'll go back to that folder, click the plus symbol again, and create a few more, one for the 80s, one for the 70s, and just go back as far as you need. Let's now navigate to the main photos library and we're gonna select all of the scanned images and drag and drop them into the album called Holding Tank. At this point, you can start to drag photos from the Holding Tank album and drop them into the appropriate albums below. Once they're all sorted, you can go into each album, select all of the photos in that album by pressing Command and the letter A on your keyboard, and then let's click on the Image menu here at the top menu bar and select Adjust Date and Time. My recommendation is to just set the date of all of these photos to January 1st of whatever decade that you're currently working in. You'll now need to repeat that process for each of the albums that you've created, and when you're done, you can switch back into the main photos library and you should see that all of the photos are now in chronological order. If this video helps you, you can really help me out by simply hitting that thumbs up like button, leave me a little well-constructed comment down below, and if you haven't already done so, please subscribe to my YouTube channel. Thank you so much for watching everyone. This is David A. Cox with Tech Talk America. Class dismissed.